Hey, what is going on guys? John Shea here. If you are brand new to the channel, make sure to give me a thumbs up and like the video. Also, if you go ahead and actually leave me a comment on the video, I will go back and actually reply back to your comment. So today we're gonna be talking about how to earn $50 a day with a kind of unique strategy I wanna be bringing to you guys here today. Um, this is something brand new that recently came out within the last year. Google has actually introduced the ability to start posting through Google business pages. So I'm gonna show you guys how you can use this as an opportunity to go out there and start working with business owners to help them increase their visibility online and help them with offers so they can start bringing in more and more business. So let's jump over to my desktop and I'm gonna show you exactly what this is all about. All right guys, so we're over on my desktop and I wanted to talk about something that recently rolled out with the new Google My Business platform. So Google has been making a ton of updates and changes to the Google My Business platform over the last couple of years. In fact, I made a program where I walk people through how to set up a Google My Business page and everything has completely changed as of the last two years. So what I wanted to do in this video is point out something very specific that you can utilize um, using uh, really just something to go out there and prospect with business owners, show them a missing opportunity that you can help them with that they're not picking up on. So the biggest thing right now I would say is that Google now has the ability to um, let you add a post um, about special events, um, special deals on products, or just general things that are going on with the business. So I'm actually, I pulled up one of my old clients here, Seagrave and Hall Insurance, and this is gonna look a little bit different for you guys depending on how you see it, but um, right now this business does not have any posts. They, um, I haven't worked with them in many, many years and I still have access to their Google My Business page and you can see here that I have the ability to go in and add a new post. So generally what you're gonna to wanna to do with this is go out and find businesses that are not utilizing this feature yet and start talking to them about, hey, you know, I'd love to help you with your Google My Business page. Um, turn this into a bigger opportunity where you can upsell them other services like website design, maybe doing SEO for them, maybe running their Facebook ads, all these other things that you could be doing um, to help them get more business. This is gonna be something you can use as a foot in the door. So let's talk about this a little bit more. Uh, if you just pick a random niche, we'll just use the painting niche. So I'm gonna say painter and I'm gonna put in a random city near me. We'll say painter North Andover. So as we go through this list here, you're gonna see a listing of, of uh, different businesses in the maps. So I'm gonna click on more places and I'm just gonna find um, a random painter here. We're just gonna go after this guy, King Painting. So I can see here that right off the bat, um, they're not utilizing this new post feature. And in fact, this particular business doesn't even have their business hours listed on their page. So this would be someone perfect that I could send an email to and let them know, you know, hey, did you know that Google has this new feature where you could be utilizing posts about special offers on painting? And, uh, you know, this would be a good way for you to get more phone calls for your business. Send them a quick little video just like this. Let them know that they're missing their business hours and that some other things could be improved upon. Obviously, the photos are on here aren't great. Like this doesn't really represent their work. It's like an exterior big office building that's brick and a street that's all pavement and a bunch of trees. So I have no representation of even what kind of work they do. They've only got one review and uh, ultimately there's a whole ton of stuff they could be doing here. So if we come back, um, once you get to the point that you've gotten access to their page, I'll actually show you guys this here really quick. Um, I'm logged into the Google My Business dashboard. You would have the end user, the business owner, go into the user section of Google My Business and they would go ahead and add you as a manager. So you can see here the owner of this business, Larry, is the primary owner of the page. He would go in and there's gonna be another section for him to do add user and he would select manager from a dropdown and pick my email address. And once you've had the business owner do that, you're basically gonna have access to their page just like I do here. So I'll have basically access to do everything except remove and add new users. But I can reply to reviews, I can change things around, I can create posts and do a whole bunch of other stuff. So what we're gonna do is head over to the left column here and go to posts. And you're basically just going to um, go through the little tutorial here, create a new product post. Um, they give you examples of the different types of posts you can do. You can write this out and do different things. So you can do this for an event coming up, um, the details of the event, the title, when it's starting. You can add a call to action like sign up or learn more. 
You can add in an offer and give details, give that a title, put a start and end, to end time on that. Maybe you want to do it for like a month or if you want to run it to the end of the year, you could add in a special coupon code, even have a redeemable link maybe through their website. And uh, ultimately you can also add specific products. So maybe if you're working with a business like this painter, for example, he could have a flat rate for doing interior painting. Maybe it's $500 for a room. You can go in and add a photo of an interior paint job, um, call this you know, interior painting, and just put a price tag of $500 on it. And now business, you know, people that are searching out painting services are gonna find this, and they're gonna know exactly how much he's offering it for, and it's gonna really just speed things up, make it easier for people to figure out you know, what are these people offering. So it's a really, really simple service to go out there and help business owners with. Um, a lot of people just are not taking advantage of it, and it's really easy for you guys to get your foot in the door with this. So I would go through and you know make a video, like show them this and be like, hey, you know, you, you guys aren't utilizing this new post feature. Let me help manage this for you. Uh, maybe offer to do it for free. And once they build some trust and credibility with you, you can then go and upsell them more services. So I wanna show you guys a quick sample of what this looks like. Um, you can see here, this is one of my mold clients that I work with, iMold. And now that we've gone ahead and made a post, I did a 10% off any water um, damage like service through the end of December, basically the entire year. So this offer now appears with this image here um, throughout the uh, entire Google My Business page. So when people see them on Google, they see, oh, I can get 10% off my service. So it's just a great way to give um, business owners something extra that they can offer to their clients. So if you guys wanna learn more about going out there and offering these kinds of services to businesses, I've actually left a link below in the video description to check out my program, the SEO Consulting Blueprint. Uh, this course pretty much walks you through everything that you need to know about going out there and starting a consulting business, offering these same kinds of services to all kinds of local businesses. So check that out. If you have any questions, feel free to leave me a comment and don't forget to subscribe to the video and I will see you in the next one.